Oh, there they go. Can't see our main force anymore. I wonder when we'll get to set off. If we don't hurry, the enemy forces will be upon us. Your brain is as dense as your belly. It's our duty to hold those forces off. Huh? Oh, right. It is, isn't it? And not simply hold them off. Once we've bought the main force some distance, we'll retreat and do this all over again. So you're saying that all the way back to the castle? Yes. No one is going to play savior for us. No matter what trouble may befall us. If your fear has the best of you, then you can run ahead. Run ahead? And join the main force? Yeah, no one would blame you for doing so. Joining up with the main force would guarantee a safe return to the castle. What's the matter? Oh. It appears not even one will take the offer. Here they come! A fight it is, then. Let the stars grant us their divine protection. We are Caleb. We will not fail! Lady Mosheri? Lynx, what's the matter? I seek your permission to return to King Rob's side. Do as you will. You're in my father's service, after all. <sighs> you plan to tell father of me, don't you? Yes. I will tell him that Lady Mosheri is going to Leonis of her own accord. I wonder, what's gotten into you? What? It is pointless to deny it, Lynx. Your true concern is Mont. It is nothing of the sort. No matter. It's not as if I don't understand how you feel, after all. <sighs> Alas, the journey will not be easy. The road is rife with danger. I understand the risk. Though I did not inform you, I was attacked on my way here. I believe they were soldiers of Fennis. Perhaps they are planning to separate me from father. But if so, they would try again. Yet you still wish to return to father's side? Leonis is our enemy. There is naught that will change my thoughts on this matter. That said, I do not wish to toil in a senseless battle. Besides, Mont put his own life at risk to protect you, Lady Mashuri, as well as Shitzelt. That is why I, too, wish to be honored. That is just like you, Lynx. Then let me ask one more thing of you. Whatever you wish, my lady. Tell Father that Shitzelt has done nothing wrong. <clears throat> what is it? Is there nothing you wish to tell Mont? If he dies here like a dog, then that is all he will ever be. Understood, my lady. I will not fail you. Not once did I underestimate Caleb, but... This will not be an easy fight. Survive, Mont. News from the battlefield, your majesty. 
Venice's first division, in pursuit of the enemy, has been completely annihilated. So it would seem our enemies fight in earnest as well. There's nothing to worry about. The fight's only just getting started. That is not all, Your Majesty. The enemy's main force has already begun its retreat. Then they are surely preparing to hole up inside the castle. In which case, Prince Stern will no doubt lead the rear guard. It is said his sword arm is rivaled only by King Elda himself, and yet the prince has never appeared in battle. He must be too scared of me to step foot out on the battlefield. That would be fine if it were the case. However, King Elda must surely have some scheme in mind. Your Majesty, it is not Stern commanding the rear guard, but the leader of Kalem, a man called Mott. Prince Mott? The clawless cub of the Lion Twins? Yes, Your Majesty. So that swine elder plans to keep Stern in reserve. If that is the case, then he has assured our victory. Solidus, move out! Strike down the enemy ranks and show no mercy! The enemy's second division is advancing! Do not falter! Engage the enemy! What's become of our main force? They are no longer visible to the naked eye from here. Then I'd say they've gained enough distance. Let's ready our retreat, but don't let your guard down. I'm counting on you, Lilith. Right. We're the rear guard. We'll hold our ground even as we turn our backs to the enemy. The time has come, huh? It seems we'll be confronting Horn's main force soon. Horn's main force? You mean Solidus? It would appear so. We could fight this battle head on hundreds of times without a single victory. But we shall fight as we withdraw. In other words, with our backs to the enemy. A fighting retreat? Can we really pull it off? We can. Or rather, we must. <sighs> Well then, let's get started. Maintain your focus. You're a shinobi of Horn. Weren't you with Mashari? I am returning to King Rob. I see. Then I hope you get back safely. <sighs> what is it? If you die here like a dog, then that is all you will ever be. Was that... A message from Mashari? No, Lady Mashari was merely speaking to herself. Is that so? Thank you. Try not to die. It would really sadden Lady Mashari if aught were to happen to you. The same goes for you. Do you think anyone would shed a tear for me? I would. Lord Mont, we must hurry. I know. Let's get going. Mont, what on earth are you doing? I don't think I can tolerate waiting any longer. <sighs> Just as I thought. Here you are. You should return to the castle tower. The evening wind weakens the strongest amongst us. 
It's said that Mont is the Elder Prince of Leonis. Indeed he is. What of it? Are you not worried? Mont would cease being a prince should the kingdom fall. Is there not a trace of a filial bond between you? No father would wish for the safe return of his child. But alas, one cannot expect to fulfill his duty as guardian if he allows his heart to waver by dwelling on such things. His duty as a guardian? Whatever do you mean? It is none of your concern. Now, into the castle tower. After all, Mont's return to the castle is not guaranteed. Last, almost time for a good long snooze. Don't lower your guard yet. I think we're safe since we made it this far, Lord Mont. Reinforcements could join us in short order. Is that truly the case? Am I missing something? If the king had that in mind, Fordham would be at the ready. However, not stirs in the castle. Silence is chilling. Surely the king's busy preparing the castle for a siege. So... Father said he has no intention of holding the castle in a siege. It won't be long now till the enemy forces surround the castle. With the preparations incomplete, the provisions inside the castle won't last long. So, our choices are... an honorable defeat, or our unconditional surrender. Hang on a second, everyone. After fighting desperately, we finally made it back to the castle. Even so, there's nothing but despair awaiting us. What's happening here? Is Father really planning on using Masheri as a hostage to bargain with Horn? It's not totally unbelievable. I cannot let that happen! I refuse to. But there doesn't seem to be any other way. <sighs> More soldiers from Venice! If I want to get back to King Rob, I'll have to hack through them first. Hmm. There's no other choice. <laughs> Welcome to hell! Prepare yourselves! This bloodlust. Show yourselves! Perfect. I'll make you pay for destroying my village right here and now. <laughs> A remnant of Saiga, just as I thought. Thought I'd get the chance to meet you if I hung around with Finnis. Ryu. Unforgivable. For what you've done, I'll show no mercy! I know it was you. You're the lowlife who killed Lady Naya! Hmm. What of it? You're next. Then it's Masheri's turn. How daring of you to share such plans. <laughs> Not at all. 
Because this is the end of the line for you. No, I cannot die here, no matter what happens. Too bad. This is where you shrivel up and die in your regrets. Daybreak. Perhaps we should consider not walking through those gates as an option. What are you saying? You do not plan on returning to the castle? <sighs> Lilith, what do you mean? Please explain. I think King Elda may not have a plan this time. But... You're right. I suspected the same thing. Uh, hold on a second here. If we're not going back to the castle, what exactly is our plan? We could always run. You're honestly suggesting that we just abandon the castle? Whether we take refuge inside the castle or not, the Onus will fall sooner or later. But if Lord Mont survives, then the Leonis bloodline can live on. Our time is running out. The decision is yours, Lord Mont, as is my sword. <laughs> my prince, make a choice. M more enemies! We cannot delay any longer, Father! Allow me to fight! I will not. Why? If I do not fight, Mont will... Must I repeat myself? <sighs> Stop, Stern! Do you intend to stand idly by and let my brother die? That depends on Mont. Must you be so merciless to those who do not share your ideals? Do not misunderstand me. My wish is for the Leonis bloodline to survive. I would gladly lay down my own life for that cause. Even so, I do not intend to show mercy to those who do not understand the worth of their blood. Are you... Are you saying that you want Brother to abandon the castle and flee? Is that... Mont? Fool. So he has chosen to return. left wide open. No reinforcements being marched out. I wonder what King Elda intends with all this. Maybe he's really eager for Lord Mont to go inside. But Lord Mont is... If you want to run, then run. I will not hold your decisions against you. Wait, are you telling us to flee? It is your best option. I cannot think of any other way. Hmm. Then allow me to do as I please. Allow me the same courtesy. <laughs> I am sorry. Thanks for everything. If only you had been placed under Stern's command instead, none of this would have happened. What is it? Why are you still here? <laughs> I wish you wouldn't underestimate us like that. 
We're Kalim, Lord Mont's sword and shield, are we not? We will be by your side, no matter where the road may take us. Let's show them what it means to be the pride of Leonis. I too serve only Lord Mont. All of you? No need to get emotional now. We've got soldiers to deal with. Mont. That flag. It's the flag of Horn's main force, Solidus. Mont! all you got? I have to admit, I'm a little disappointed. Was expecting to have a bit more fun with you. Such a pity. King Rob must hurry. Still got some life in you, huh? Not yet ready to die. <laughs> uh! Well, what's the matter? Plead for your life. <sighs> huh. How boring. Already at your dying breaths. Let me put you out of your misery. <sighs> what? What's so funny? There's no one easier to defeat. Cocky little lowlife. What? Why you? What the? She went and jumped off the damn cliff. <laughs> now things are getting interesting. Cling to life, if that's how it is. Next time we meet, I'm going to make you beg for death. What? <sighs> Lord Mont, what's wrong? I heard Masheri's voice. If so, then you must respond. What? It doesn't look like Lady Masheri is anywhere to be found. And yet, you heard her voice all the same. A revelation from the gods, perhaps. Impossible. Lord Mont, the wave of enemy forces has stopped. Seems we've earned a brief respite, eh? My prince, it's time to make a choice. Yes, we'll enter the castle and discover Father's true intent. As ordered, the castle gates remain open. That will do. Forgive me, your majesty, but will that not allow the enemy to breach the castle? Do you not understand? With our gates closed, the enemy will strike at full force. However, open gates give off the scent of a trap. 
causing them to doubt their next move. Understood, Your Majesty. Forgive my impudence. That said, this situation cannot be maintained forever. Helena and Stern shall remain in the castle. F Father! Mont and I shall leave. There will be no quarrel. What of Marcherie? It'd be folly to take her with us. Marcherie, this is where we must part. I leave Schitzelt in your care. He's in no state to return to Horn yet. I understand. He's in good hands. <laughs> I will return for you. You have my word. But can you keep your word? If you have faith in me. What? Your faith will make me stronger. Stronger than I've ever been. Then you shall have it. Become stronger than anyone else, Mont. Then come and claim me, before I forget you. Understood? Mother and I are to remain here while you escape. Is that the way of it, Father? Disappointed, I take it. Your ploy is to make hostages out of us. Make of it what you please. Why do you refuse to fight? If we are to escape, then why not do so together as a family? Never forget. The Leonis line shall live on, even should we fall afoul of gods to defend it. Father, I've but one request. I will gladly remain here, so I beg of you. Please take Mother with you. If what were to happen to her, Helena stays. No matter what? Enough! I cannot abide this! This is no more than a sad excuse to save your own skin! Stern! If my life is to be forfeit, may my enemy be one or many. I'll slay them all. Stern. I'll stain the earth red with my own blood. You plan to die? Never has the thought of dying crossed my mind, but I forsake Leonis. That is all. Helena. Protect the bloodline of Leonis at any cost. At any cost? That is my wish, yes. King Elda, requesting permission to depart for the front. Granted. My apologies, O. To have embroiled my honored guest in all of this. I'm afraid this comes with the territory of being a knight, only as I may be. But that's fate, isn't it? <laughs> Let us depart. Seize the proper opportunity to surrender. This bloodline is all, remember? I am well aware. Mother, I beg of you to yield as soon as you are able. Are you a half-wit? What time would an early surrender buy us? You put their lives in danger for the sake of our own. It's... It's for the sake of the Leonis bloodline. Mont. Stay safe. Safe as I can. It is time. Schitzelt, are you all 
right? Yes, my lord. King Elda and Lord Mont have escaped through the rear gates. Damn. Lord Stern, do not despair. <clears throat> Surely King Elda has a plan. Do not talk as if you know how I feel! Uh, forgive me, Master. I just... Don't forget, I was abandoned too, by my own father. I had not forgotten. Have you ever thought ill of your father? At first, my heart was ruled by nothing but hatred. However, now, I think not of it at all. Why is that? Because I was taken in by you, Lord Stern. I met you because I was abandoned. I'd say I was pretty lucky, wouldn't you? Then please return to the castle. Don't waste the precious luck you found. <laughs> Shed your terror, my lord. I have no intention of throwing my life away. Huh? You came here in order to live. Of course. A master always wishes to put on a show for his apprentice. <laughs> Ready for a challenge? He who kills the most wins. I'm always game for some friendly competition. Beware. I will give it my all. Lady Marcherie. Queen Helena! No matter what befalls us, I wish for Stern to live. Please, I require your assistance. Queen Helena. No, Queen Mother. Please rest easy. My life is already indebted to your son, Mont, so I will return the favor. Wait! Stay your swords, we shall not fight. But Lord Stern, I can still fight. I will protect the Queen Mother. My apologies, but we shall not go further. I am not like Father. I'm not like that man. I would never abandon Mother. Never! What are you doing here? We're to take Helena and Stern. We think not. What did you say? Any grievances can be taken up with me personally. And just to let you know, I have a hard time settling grievances gently. <sighs> These two are my guests. Treat them with our greatest hospitality. Is that clear? Yes, Your Highness. It shall be done. We have news, Your Majesty. We have custody of not only Lady Lashree, but Queen Helena and Prince Stern as well. 
I see. So Masheri is unharmed. What do you wish to do with the Queen and Prince of Leonis, Your Majesty? I want them handed over to me. They're bitter enemies of Fennis, the pair of them. I've always dreamed of ending the Leonis bloodline myself. Same goes for any that get in my way. I have word from Lady Masheri to welcome the Queen and Prince of Leonis with the greatest of hospitality, Your Majesty. Hmm. Of course I never considered this a one-sided trade. I'll allow sweet Lady Masheri to return to Horn. Do we have a deal? You have left me no choice. Then if that is settled, I shall check on Masheri. Excuse me. Ryu, what happened? I dealt with a shinobi from Horn. Just what I'd expect of a master from Goga. That's why you're worth top coin. It seems that shinobi was sent to Rob courtesy of Mashari. Then there's no way of Rob knowing what Mashari and Shitzelt have been through yet. That should be the case. What of Elda and his other princely runt? It seems they fled through the rear gate of the castle with Kalem. Leaving behind their beloved to scurry off into the night. A brigade has already been dispatched in pursuit. Just what I wanted to hear. I'll join them after. Understood. wrong I just got the strangest feeling that we were being watched it might be Moraga right we should hurry there's no time to waste Shitzelt, can I ask you something? What is it? Why did Horn join swords with Fennis? A fine question. I too would like to hear your answer. Fennis's military might is indeed impressive, but an alliance with a country like that will lead to naught but problems. It was because of Rundal, which lies to the west. Rundal? The so-called dragon-eating stag? That house, Rundall? Rundall's invasions to the east become a more menacing reality by the minute. Hence... I see. You sought desperate measures to curb Rundall's aggression. That is when Sadali stepped in to be the mediator. Sadali! Isn't he the founder of the Crystal Sanctum? So it was his scheme. Be that as it may, to agree to wed one's precious daughter to that savage of a man. We were told that Moraga was not but a barbarian with a lust for battle. Alas, that was before we met. The Moraga I saw was fluent in our tongue. So much so that he seemed a different person entirely. I know what you mean. I felt the same way. Not to mention, his skills have improved remarkably since we last crossed swords. Though it pains me to admit it, even with Shitzelt by my side, we couldn't put an end to him. Perhaps that feckless swine has used some means to gain more power. To gain more power? 
It couldn't be. An ancient relic? Mashari. Father! You are safe. I can rest assured at last. King Elda treated me as an honored guest. More importantly, I ask that you protect Queen Helena and Prince Stern. Hmm. Father? They are to be delivered to Fenis. A deal was struck with King Moraga not long ago. Why would you do that? Why would you strike such a deal? Oh no. You never heard from Lynx? From Lynx? No. She has been missing for quite some time. <sighs> what am I missing here? Actually... Muraga has been pulling the strings all along. Alas, is there no proof of this conspiracy? Proof is hard to come by. Muraga doesn't strike me as capable of such devious plots. It is possible that Sodaly gave him the idea. Are there no means with which to reclaim Queen Helena and Lord Stern? Perhaps if you were to take their place in Fenis, an agreement could be reached. Then that is what I shall do. No, I'll never submit to those terms. Father! But I'll persuade Moraga not to do them any harm. It would not be wise for him to refuse my terms. We still have his daughter. Father, about Moraga's daughter. According to King Elda, he doesn't have one. What? That fiend! What on earth are you planning? Mont. Lord Mont. Please accept my sincerest apologies for my many instances of discourtesy to date. I can't let you go. Pardon? You wish to part ways with us and go it alone, don't you? But if we are to keep our current course east, we'll enter Wazette territory. Worry not. Leonis and Wazette are bound by an alliance. Alas, I am not... Of Horn any longer? Is that not so? Uh. <laughs> uh. I don't understand why you all treat me so. And not just you, Lord Mont, but even Lilith. Have you heard that Lilith lost Volca? Her brother? Yes, Lord Mont. Upon his death, Lilith fell into despair and vanished. To this day, she refuses to speak at length of what happened during the two years she went missing. But one day, she came back. Yes. She told me of how the people she met while wandering the lands helped her realize what she needs to do. She must have had good encounters. Because of that, Lilith must wonder if she has what it takes to carry out that duty herself. <sighs> that memory inspired me to take you with me now. So, I understand. It's none of my concern. But, I 
could not leave you in that state. I am truly thankful. Shitzelt. To think that someone finds even my broken self to have purpose. I must take solace in knowing that. Lend me your strength, and together we'll defeat Moraga. He's powerful. Our lives may be forfeit in another confrontation. I am ready. Have no doubt. I understand. Oh, so this is where you have been. You are sought by King Elda. Father needs me? It seems we are under attack. What? Shouldn't you have said that sooner? Shitzelt! I'm with you. This castle has fallen. That is not all. The Queen, Helena, and the younger Prince Stern are both in hand. The real message here is that Elda and Mont have slipped out of our net, is it not? Yes, Your Holiness. <laughs> no matter. Then perhaps I, too, should greet Leona's castle with my presence. You would go in person, Your Holiness? Little birds have been telling rumors of Stern for quite some time now. I have long desired to have him under my control by any means necessary. And lo, to realize that dream at so soon a juncture. <laughs> 